What's going on YouTube? Street High Vintage with sold items number 31. <clears throat> Alright, first one we got is the vintage, uh, I think 2007 or 2008 Spider-Man movie, Spider-Man 3, board shorts, uh, these are youth size. These ones just sold today, actually. Yeah, 2007. And these are another pair of um, swim trunks. Yeah, these are swim trunks. The other ones are swim trunks too. These ones are some vintage, <clears throat> vintage uh, big dogs swim trunks. This one I had for a while, 2012 Liquid Blue, Jerry Garcia, Grateful Dead t-shirt. Not Grateful Dead, but Jerry Garcia band. Uh, we got that quarter zip Georgia Bulldogs uh, long sleeve. This one's brand new without tags. I remember copping this at the flea market for like five bucks. They had another team, or I, they might have had another one of these. Nah, I think it was like another team. I should have copped it too, just because the uh, the logo on it, like the thing's hella sick. Just the boldness on this lettering right here, and this quarter zip. Yeah, this one's a banger. Dude. I should have copped the other one. If I go back and I see it, I'm going to copy it for sure. This one's a banger. Look at that. Damn. We got the... Renegades basketball jersey. Like I'm not too sure if this is like a pro team or whatever amateur team, but the style on it's hella sick. It's hella savage looking. That R and the Renegades, and it's a reversible too. So yeah, that's why this one sold. This one got was getting hella clout on Depop. Uh, this one sold finally. I think a Depop sale too. Got that skull with the gra uh, dragon graphics on it. Hella crazy. This is some um, uh, X Games merch. 
I got this out of the thrift haul at the some garage sale. Some dude was having hella X Games from San Francisco, like in 2000s. Like merch over there or something. Hella t-shirts, motocross. That's why I cop this shirt right here. But this one ain't for sale. This is like personal. On a single stitch too. Yeah, that's, that's, that's just a showpiece that I'm going to have out when I do my pop-ups. If they want it, they're going to cash me out like a rack for it, but this one ain't for sale. I ain't going to let it go for a hundred. I don't know. But yeah, sold this one. This one's pretty sick. This I remember copping up in Vegas because that's the only place like close to Arizona. That's where I was getting this uh, dope ass Arizona merch. I had this other shirt I caught from there. That shit had a sick ass graphic like a donkey on there and up in the desert. Shit was savage. But this one's sick right here too. Dope essential. This one's a Arizona single stitch t-shirt on the Onita. Yeah, I need to hit Vegas one time. Or actually, I'm trying to do a thing where I do um, a different state every month. Because I ain't trying to just, like, be stuck over here, like, all the time. Like, all year and shit, whatever. So, at least every month, go to a different state. I'll be sick. So, within, like, four to five years. Nah, I say within four years, I've been in, like, every state. Alright, we got the city. This one, uh, I think a Poshmark sale. Golden State Warriors, City Drip, Snapback, Mitchell and S, Two Tone. Yeah, I'm about to watch that game tonight. I think it's game three, the Warriors playoff. Got some light discoloring right there, but it's like hard to tell. Or it might be right here somewhere. But good ass condition still. Remember copping this one. This shit was hella filthy. I scrubbed it down hella good with uh, some Dawn soap and some water and a toothbrush. Just like getting down. Like, probably took like 30 minutes. Almost 40 minutes to clean this. But now I got it looking hella good. I mean, this shit was like dingy as hell. A hella dirty looking. You couldn't even see the whiteness, but now this shit look hella clean. So this is that no uh, vintage, no fear uh, fitted hat. Yeah, this one was filthy too. And if you've seen the other videos, you would have seen like that Raider hat that was sitting there. In this area that has been sitting there for like a month. So I finally cleaned that one. And that's the Shark Tooth Raider hat. And shit, you know what? I haven't even listed that damn hat, dude. The hell am I waiting on? That's like, in that condition, that's over like $100 for that hat. I think I paid like a buck for it too. Just sitting there in my hat rack, hat section, like like it's ready photo session, all that. I have not even took a photo picture of it. I'm just cleaning it up and then it sit there. All right, so we got that pinstripe Polo Ralph Lauren colorway, um, color yeah colorway uh, long sleeve shirt. Yeah, these colors are sick. Collab, dope together. But this is like on the stiff collar, you can hell tell. Yeah, it's more like a dress, a dress shirt. 
This hell was sick though. It took me like a long ass time to sell this one too. But shout out to the purchaser of this dope piece right here. And this one, this one, this one. This one was a banger. This had like almost a hundred likes or probably over a hundred likes on Depop. So it was like one of the grills I had. But someone gave me an offer. I just had to let it go. Because I ain't going to be sitting on this for another year. This is that vintage, uh, vintage dragon uh, flame button down shirt. Even the dragon print looks hella vintage. It's sick. I think this one might be a double sided. On that TD tag XL. Yeah, look at that. Double sided. That's just clean. So this was a grill. This was a grill, but I sold it as a banger price. It was priced up there, but I let it go for like half. Oh shit, nah. Pulling out the new stuff. Yeah, that was the last piece right here. But that's about it for this episode of Sold Items number 30, I think. I'm not quite sure. But thank y'all for, thank my supporters and my customers and everybody that's been helping me put this, helping me hold it down. And you go ahead and check out my Instagram page at Shark City Vintage. But my Depop link on there is active, and that one is Street Hype Vintage. Or you go to um, Depop.com, Street Hype Vintage. Macari, it's Street Hype Vintage. Poshmark is JDub82 with two Bs, J D U B 82 Or you uh, hit eBay, 90s Skater Hip Hop Streetwear on the keywords, and my listings will pop up. And yeah, I'm about to do some uh, listings today after I do the refreshings. And yeah, we want to wish y'all a good day.